Today, I'm gonna be ranking every single Stumble Guys emote in a tier list. So hopefully by the end of this video, you will know exactly what emotes you should be using in game. So right here is the tier list. There's S tier, which means it's the best. You can't get better. A tier, B tier, C tier, D tier, F tier. F tier, I mean, what even emote am I gonna put on F tier? Taunt. I'll put Taunt on F tier. Oh, in all seriousness, Taunt definitely is not going on freaking F tier. Taunt's probably S or A. I don't know. We'll see. That's the last one I'm ranking. So first, we have invisibility. Now, I'm not gonna lie. I hate invisibility. But it does have its uses, like on Lava Land, to where you go invisible, nobody knows where you are, and you go to invisibility, smack some kid in the head. So I'm gonna put invisibility on... Yeah, I feel like it's either B or C. I'm gonna put on C. Alright, Mr. Beast Lightning is next. To troll, it's S tier, for sure. But in actual use, I'm not gonna lie, I think it's C tier. C I, I think it's C tier. I mean, it, it's, it sucks. The cooldown is really long, it's really inaccurate, and uh, yeah, C tier, for sure. Alright, next up we got the hug. Now, I honestly love hug. And I only just recently swapped out hug for barrier, because I, fe I felt barrier had more use, and since I don't use taunt, you know, I need something. And so... I think I'm gonna put the frickin' heart. I think it's either B or A. You know what? I'm, I'm putting it A tier. Hey, hey, smack me in the face. I think it's A tier. It can, it can win you 1v1s easily, okay, on laser maps. And you literally have control over another human. I might regret it. I might move that later. It's staying at A tier right now. Punch S, bro. No even frickin' thought behind that. Punch is so good. I love punch. You can combo with it. You can punch people with it. Did you, did you guys know that? Yes, he went to the Oh, DD. Oh, what it is. Oh, DD. What? Oh, yeah. Kick S tier. Kick breaks blocks. Kick can hit multiple people. Kick can give you great movement in game. So, like, even if you don't have volleyball, you can use kick to, to be way faster than the average stumbler Joe, okay? Banana. Ooh, now, see, this is where we get a little... This, this is where, you know, I don't think it's the worst in, in the world, but I don't think it's good. You throw a banana, it sits there the entire game, and then, you know, what do you do? You, you pray that somebody touches it. You pray somebody's going to touch your banana, and nobody ever does. Y you have four emotes you can equip. So is anybody going to be equipping banana? Definitely the frick not. Oh, shoot. We got volleyball next. Oh, shoot, bro. Man, I think I gotta put it in S tier. Bro, it's the best movement item by far. Faster than kick, faster than walking. You can press volleyball, have your brain unplug, just hold W, and you will go to the end of the map before anybody else, just because you have volleyball. And then there's also the use to where on Lava Land, if there's a three block high jump, you can jump up it. And then on block dash, there's two block high jumps that you can get over with volleyball. I mean, volleyball is just so insanely good in all fronts. Briefcase. Now, briefcase is definitely better than banana. Just because it's like a, it's like a, kind of like a shotgun shot. Like you just throw it in front of you and pray that it freaking domes some kid. And then if you miss, it just sits on the floor. So I think, honestly, I'd put it in the C tier. It's a little bit better than banana. But I still don't think you're ever going to see players rocking the briefcase. It's, uh, yeah. C, yeah, C. C tier. All right, next we have electric hug. Same thing as hug. I still think it belongs in the A tier. It's just a good emote. I love it. All right, we have kick again. Obviously S tier. Def, like, come on now. Now we have karate chop. Now this is like, oh, I, I don't have punch. Oh, and, and I don't have spatula. So I think it honestly belongs in the B tier. Because, you know, I would use Karate Chop over Invisibility and Lightning and Briefcase and Banana. But if I have Punch, I ain't freaking equipping this. Oh, gosh, we have Snowball. Bro, I honestly think this belongs in the F tier. This is such an awful emote. And, and of, of recently, too, if you Snowball someone, the effect doesn't even show them slowed. So you don't even know if you hit anyone, and the person who got hit doesn't even know if they got hit because the snowball does nothing, bro. If you're gonna YOLO out some throwable, use a briefcase, use a banana, use even Mr. Beast Lightning, bro. Don't, you're, you honestly are making a better choice for yourself just going in Viz and praying. Now we have Barrier. 
which honestly, the emote hasn't been out for long, so I haven't gotten to use it a lot. But here's where Barrier sucks, okay? Barrier 1 has a cast time. So if you want to get barriered up and not get hit by emotes or spikes, you got bloop, and then you have it. So that little bloop is cancelable. You can punch someone out of that, and it takes a long time, so it stops your character and it slows it down. And then my other complaint about barrier is it lasts for about two seconds. I think I might put it, I, it's, it, it's between C or D, bro. This emote's just so, so bad. I think I'll put it at D right now. It's just, it's such a bad emote, which is funny because I'm running barrier, right? Instead of hug. I, I honestly don't know why I am. I think after today, I might switch back to hug. But yeah, barrier D for sure. All right, next up, we got golden banana. I would honestly put it a little bit behind regular banana just because it's, it's uglier. <laughs> But I actually think I'd put barrier in front. Let me, I, I forgot about like that determines like S tier, right? If it's in the front of S tier, that means it's better than these other S tier ones. So hold on, let me remake the list real quick to accurately get like the S tier ones being in the order of which I think they are. Okay, not much moved, but uh, I did put kick in front. I think kick is the best emote in S tier so far. And I think the un water kick is better because it doesn't make this dumb effect. And I think having more effects on your screen is just dumb. And that's why the regular heart is in front of the electric heart. Because I don't like having more effects on your emotes. Just, just let them do what the emotes are supposed to do, you know? And hey, that, that, that brings me up to fire punch. Yeah. So, yeah, hey, just honestly, fire punch. I, I don't need this fire effect, okay? If I miss the punch, I'm gonna look like an idiot. So, might as well just have the regular one. All right, next we have Spatula, which honestly, Spatula is really good because of the fact that it will bring you out of a dive. So if you're diving and you're midair and you Spatula, you will stand back up. Or if you're diving on the floor and you want to stop sliding around like a penguin, like I so very often do, you can just Spatula and it will get you off of the dive and you can keep moving. So it's, it's quite different from Punch in that aspect. And I think it's honestly A tier and I think it goes in front of the hearts too. Because it's a punch, and it stops you from sliding. The only thing that sucks about Spatula and why it's not in the S tier is because the cooldown is about twice as long as the punch. So if you only have Spatula, it's, it's not doing you any favors because you only get to throw out the punch half as much as you could if you just had the punch. All right, now we got the last two. And oh my gosh, Tetris Blog, you're going right to the freaking top, baby, where you belong. Sitting on the top of the throne. Because, oh my gosh, need I explain the Tetris block? I, I don't. I don't think I do. Because the Tetris block is so good. It's so insane. It's punch, but it's also briefcase. But it's also just a super punch. And uh, it's also just... Bro, it's literally... It does everything. So, yeah, Tetris block cruising easily at the best emote in the game. But wait, is it? Because low-key, Tetris block isn't good for race. So I might actually put kick in front because kick can be competitive. It can be offensive. It can be defensive and it can help you in race. So I think all around actually kick is the better emote. And then we have taunt this busted freaking OP stupid thing that needs to be deleted. They need to make barrier taunt. They need to make barrier taunt and nerf taunt, bro. Taunt is so OP. I would honestly put taunt. I don't know which one, though. It is so OP. I mean, I would rather have kick than taunt, obviously. But, bro, taunt cancels your movement. Taunt makes you invincible to every projectile in the game, every punch in the game. Tetris block, karate chop, Mr. Beast lightning, banana. Bro, it doesn't matter what you get hit by. Taunt makes you literally invincible. You'll just stand still. Taunt brings you over the spikes and block dash. So, yeah, taunt's easily probably the second best thing in the game. I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with this tier list. I mean, let me know if you guys see any flaws. I think it's perfect. Okay, I think we're done. That was That's great. Now, wait, 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 wait. Before we finish this video, I forgot about this new spit emote. I didn't put it in the tier list uh, at the beginning because I'll be honest, I forgot it existed. And when I played the beta, it just didn't work for me. But I did watch some of my homies, shout out to Smore Kyle, use this emote. And you basically... And then you spit a projectile that goes straight and it knocks people. So I do like it. It's kind of like a Hadouken to where like you do it, it goes straight, and then if it hits someone, it hits someone. 
So that's why I'm putting it in B tier, and that's why this is a D tier emote, is because of the cast time, okay? Nobody's gonna sit there and cast up this freaking loogie in their mouth and then spit it for two seconds. But I think it's cool having a miniature Hadouken in the stumble, guys. So, yeah, B tier. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you think I did anything wrong. I personally think this tier list is flawless. And let me know if you want to see any more videos like this in the comments. Make sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you boys in the next one. God bless. And bye-bye.